Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me. My name is Mr. Mokolov, of course. And let's continue playing as the Soviet Union. So, we are slowly moving, getting ready to invade France. Eh, we kind of are already, but that's our goal currently. France. We took the long, super hard, difficult way to get to France. So, that's okay with me. I've got quite a bit of industry infrastructure. We're trying to take out southern France. That's our goal. Montpellier. We've made some more encirclements. Once we kill off the French, the Benelux, the rest of the Benelux will fall, and I can start planning an invasion of England and push all the enemies outside of Europe. Oh, oh yeah, so we have more free dockyards, of course. Just because I do not want my navy naval fleet to be hit too hard, because this one lost like 53 destroyers or something like that. An absolute insane amount last time. I need some of these units here. Wait, is that French? That's a French flag, but it says Democratic People's Republic of Korea. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. Well... Spain has stopped taking so many casualties. The Jap Japanese have taken the same amount as the United States. I've taken more than double the UK. But I've capitulated quite a few countries already. Go figure. Here, we've still suffered a lot, a lot of casualties. Uh, we're still trying to produce a lot of stuff. No matter how laggy it gets. Oh, we just overran a bunch of divisions. Nice. Alright, and 15 divisions will just become overran. And there we go. That was so beautiful. So beautiful. Actually, go here. Republic in Spain, I might advise you to take these places out. Highly would advise it. Would highly advise it, I should say. Any day now. Maybe I can improve the, uh... Ooh, the fall of Manila. Nice. I guess Japan took Manila. Or maybe someone else did. Ooh, this looks promising. Floating airfield. More sortie efficiency and more organization. That'll come and help. That'll definitely come and help. Battleship. Ooh. Grand Battle Fleet. Nice. So, the rest of southern France is exposed. Love it. You know what, let's just redraw battle plans for this guy. You're right there. Your goal is from here to Paris, basically. Reorganize yourself, please. Work with the uh, Spanish units. How many casualties has France taken now? 1.18 million, nice. Key point bombing, strategic bombing goes up by 10%. We are now running out of things to research. Rocketry, sure. Anyone over here? Push a little further in, and then we will assault. I want a wide front with my main army. Huge main army. Coast Guard Division, of course. Loads of factories. I wish I could release the Raj as a puppet already. That would be kind of nice. Well, it wouldn't be kind of nice. It would be very nice. These guys are, should be dug in or so. You guys could probably go around here. You probably go down there. Probably go down there. Because once this area is done, we'll take out the Marines. We'll take out the Marines and invade Norway through Oslo, hopefully. Or anywhere relatively close. Still repairing. 
done by early 1949. Take about half of y'all assault. Take another two and assault. Looks good. How is air superiority? How do we not have it yet? Oh, I can conquer Afghanistan now. That'd be nice. Plans are doing a pretty good job. I want you guys to go here, to Pakistan. So then you can help support the boys when they invade. Oh. Let's see, let's detach them when they invade Afghanistan. Just kind of plug up a line there real quick. Yeah, that would help. That would be good. Japan's there. I need some of these Chinese divisions to help out, though. L Laos divisions? Lao divisions? Maybe the Siamese divisions. Why do I own this? Well, how many divisions does Siam have? Or Cambodia. How about Cambodia? 51. I'll take 40. Forty divisions under one of my star generals. By star generals, by uh, someone who's not completely incompetent. Put you on the border here and take out Singapore. That's your goal. You should be put in the far east, and you shall succeed. You will succeed. Algiers, huh? Algiers has a lot of uh, anger towards me. Air superior, superiority, we don't need that there. You can go here. And then go up there. Oh, in southern France. Of course. Do I have naval bombers there? I can move the naval bombers out, actually. Yeah, here we go. I want you to reside here. Amsterdam. Yeah, they're here. And help the English Channel. Ooh, well, we've done some stuff already. All right, kind of watch what happens in Belgium. I want a bunch of you guys to attack. I want everyone here to attack Ghent. A little bit of help from this side. Uh, we could probably throw a couple more soldiers in there. Which I would avert some soldiers. All of you to attack. Whoa, why are we losing? Don't tell me I'm going to tell this guy to assault. Well, I guess we have to. A four in. Through one province, hopefully. Lastly... Ready to attack Afghanistan, it looks like. This was probably a bad idea, but let's do it anyways. Of course, they join the Allies. Don't care. Select all. Go ahead. You're going to have to be put down in this command. That looks good. Uh, we need a war justification against Saudi Arabia. Shouldn't take too long. A couple days, maybe a couple months. Barrigan, you can go there. Alright. Norwegians in the United States keep losing convoys, which is great to see. Actually, really, really good to see. We didn't lose, we didn't win the Battle of Ghent, basically. Did suffer some casualties. We've hit 2 million. Definitely a two million. The French are a tough nut to crack here. What if we try to attack Switzerland? These four with all of these 
and most of these guys. We should be able to win. Not sure how we're not winning. Oh, we just had air superiority there. Come on. If you can hear it. Ah, oh, there we go. I might have just double nuked it. There we go. Now we're winning that one. Yeah, we took the first part of Switzerland. It's a lot of casualties. A lot of equipment losses. But that's okay. Very, very nice. Dude, dude. Oops. I'm to do this. Very good. Ooh, more Coast Guards. Good. I definitely need you right now. Because there's so much coast that has to be guarded here. Here. Madras. And... Go right there. Amabad or something? I know it's part of modern-day Pakistan, so... Let's see how this is going. Alright. The Afghans seem to have more soft attack currently. Hope we can win. I'd like to take these guys out. Oh, I forgot about... Oh, wow, there's a lot of people here. Holy crap. Close air support fighters, tactical bombers, strategic bombers. That should that should definitely help out. I forgot about these guys. Fighters and close air support. Let's go up here. And they can help out in southern France. And these 100... Where could we, we use them? Well, I guess southern India. That'd be fine. I can do India as well. Benelux. Not doing so great. France is tough to kill, man. Two subs. Turkey. Still there. Still there, Turkey. Alright. Not much is really going on. There's not much I can do unless I outproduce them. With equipment. Now, these guys to invade here. Alright, we sunk a sub of theirs, sink in another sub, I lost another sub, another sub, maybe another sub, and nothing. Not bad. Alright, are you guys done repairing yet? No? How many more ships need to get repaired? Holy cow. Well, I think you'll be okay, yes. Should be okay for now. Because we gotta get rid of a lot of these supplies. So, no forts. Be a little more aggressive. Everyone here to be a little more aggressive as well. Or maybe I should select you instead. Arabian Sovereignty, go ahead, push, if we take a bunch of casualties, I really, oh my gosh, I really don't care, okay, and then we lost four convoys, it's okay, we are taking quite a beating, frickin' Americans, I'm not sure how anyone's supposed to win the war now. Uh, planes versus my convoys. Uh-oh. That is a big British fleet. Big offensive. Go ahead. 
really push them out. Yeah, at this point, not much can be really be done at this. I might just end this playthrough here, because it's getting almost impossible to play. Because France is just uh, so tanky. You just can't get air superiority. You're going to take insane amount of casualties like I am right now. Holy crap. You can't break through the lines. It's like World War One. Oh, we could take these guys and go all the way down. And cut the Magonaut line off. That would be good. Um, where are you at? They're waiting for Sweden. You can go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. 14, go ahead. You guys go ahead as well. Should help things out. France will get smaller. We'll take an insane amount of casualties, but that's okay. We can, we can do it. Uh, can't really read what's going on here. Oh. As long as I don't lose any of them carriers. Let's see. We lost a lot of planes. Alright. Hmm. Let me do this one. But for real, I mean, if we can't break through, I might just end the series here in this episode. Because this is what it's only going to be like. I mean, my soldiers have the best equipment, they best everything, just like the enemies do. And we just can't break through. I mean, if we can't get air superiority, even though I'm probably producing more than each individual country, the United States is overpowered and stuff. Anyways. I don't know. I mean, just an insane amount of bloodshed will be had if we can't break through. Alright, what's going on over here? Oh, we lost something. Lost a destroyer. Another destroyer. Uh, darn it. Argentina took over my little coup puppet. My little coup people. Oh, Switzerland's definitely getting smaller. There we go. Switzerland has fallen. Nice. I've assumed we've taken, yep, over 3 million casualties. United States has taken a bunch, so has France. Alright. Alrighty. Victory. Alright, not bad. Now France is going to feel the full wrath of my mega armies. I hope we can get to uh, Paris soon. I really do. What happened here? Another ace pilot promoted. What's going on? Alright. Belgium just Belgium does not want to give up. Oh, it looks like we surrounded the Magnet line. We will win. If I take four million casualties, I don't really care. Revolution in Saudi Arabia. Oh, with with the Republican Spain help, we surrounded a couple divisions. That's always good. Oh, Nor Norway is falling. Wow. I kind of wasn't expecting that to happen. Soon. Your goal is to conquer this place. Kick them out. Oh, let's prepare to invade Switzerland. Switzerland? No, Switzerland's gone. Let's prepare to invade Sweden. So we... Alright. Not bad. Looking pretty good, honestly. Alpine region, yeah. At least get rid of uh, France. Oh, there goes Afghanistan. 
evade from here to about there, like what we said, what I said before. If you do invade from Wilhelmshaven to here, that'd be great. And oh, we lost a destroyer. Oh wow! Oh my gosh, we lost so many men so far. But it was necessary to take France and Belgium. Five percent training time. Loading fortress. Output. That's okay. Ten million men. Not bad. Not bad. Nineteen forty-nine. Subdetection. Lost another destroyer. Whatever. These guys will die, and then we'll take Paris. And then we might call it game, because honestly, at this point, it's pretty boring. Not much is going to happen. Go ahead and take out South Africa. Go down, go around. All the good stuff. At this point, it's just going to become just too laggy, too difficult to really finish the enemies off. Alright. Wish I had air superiority so I could, you know, just knock out the enemies. Go to Paris. Take about half. Go here. Seriously, how many planes do they have? Your superiority is all over the place. What if I nuked this? Should be able to. If I keep clicking the button, it might just happen. Wow, level 10 forts in Paris? Yeah. That's insane. Okay. You have nothing to do. You shall help me invade Sweden. You can go ahead whenever. Go ahead whenever. Uh, don't invade just yet. Gotta make sure France falls first. What happened here? Sub died. Ooh, excavation five. Instead of oil, why not? Ooh, oil doing much better now. Much much better. Need more rubber though. Uh, stuff here, here, da da da. Uh, lost another destroyer. We will take Paris eventually. It has level 10 forts, which just sucks. But we technically don't need Paris to capitulate them. That's a thought. Lots and lots of losses. How are my naval ships here? Ooh, it looks like the South Africans or Dutch actually invaded China. Hmm. Oh, so did New Zealand. That's not good. Uh, you guys, go ahead. Invade. Be a little more reckless with that. Maybe they'll capitulate pretty quickly. Maybe not. Japan invaded the Philippines. Hasn't done much with it, though, yet. 81. Search and destroy. Go ahead. Pretty well healed. Eh. I just want to see France fall. First. Look at all these freaking pockets, dude. Take these guys out. That'd be great. And they have fallen. Nice. And there goes France. See, we didn't even need to capture Paris. Well, I think I might just end it here. I mean, I had a pretty good fun run as the Soviets, but at this point, it's 1949. 
the United States and all the allies have been producing equipment out the ass like crazy. Uh, I took over all of Asia. Took out a huge portion, almost all of Africa. Middle East is gone. Most of Europe is gone. It's just little remains of France, uh, Sweden, UK, of course. Eh, I can finish these puppies off first. These little peoples. Other than that, I mean, it's just pretty laggy. Paris has fallen, of course. London. Eh, the United States. The United States would be just take forever to kill. I, sh I should have attacked them sooner, but... This game is really situated for just World War II, not World War III. You know, not bad. I had a pretty good run. It took me a while to play as the Soviet Union again. As you can tell. Um, other than that, no. British Parliament de debates intervention in the Benelux. Uh, it's a little old. It's a little old. Where are these guys? Why don't you go to Cherbourg? But, uh, yeah. I like seeing the huge naval battles. I thought that was a lot of fun. Actually, last thing I want to do before I quit. Yeah, they're already doing that. I want to say that we invaded the UK. Nice. I would like all divisions in Dunkirk, and all of these guys in Ghent, so when my boys make it, we can invade together. And they have almost made it. And they made it. Nice. They both made it. So we made the UK right before everything ended. Ships on low strength. Wow, we got bombed to hell. And let's read this last ones. We killed USS Providence. Destroyer 1. Destroyer 1. Oh my gosh. Convoys. That was it? All the bombing that we what happened? Anyways. Yeah, I guess this is the end of the, of the series here with the, the Soviet Union. I enjoy the Soviet Union. I think they're pretty fun. Germany was pretty easy to beat. Uh, the game is getting pretty laggy. The United States would be really freaking hard to kill without air superiority and I do have a lot of nukes but I don't know just not as much fun. I, the biggest gripe in this uh, playthrough I had is that I wish you could create puppets while you're still, still at war with the puppet country. So for example I took over Turkey here I wish you could create a Turkish puppet state just like what Germany did during World War II with like Poland of government, uh, Ukrainian government, Reichskommissart Ostland just having the puppet created while they're still at war so they can use the resources fully and efficiently and they can give you their soldiers it would be much really nice because I took over India and I could use all of India's soldiers if I had a communist Indian government so that's my biggest gripe in this playthrough so guys if you enjoyed this playthrough if you've seen the entire thing through or even just watched one episode I hope you enjoyed it like I said before I know I did uh, I hope I hope you leave a like uh, you'll be watching this by the time it's in I think December, maybe even January, because I recorded this quite a bit earlier by the time I release this, but anyways, uh, we'll see what next I play as, so, hope I will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.